Hi, I'm Claire Richardson, founder of Relux, and welcome to our first episode in our new series of Closet Relux, where we show you how to edit your wardrobe with a little help from some friends. Today I'm in East London to rummage through the closet of Laura Jackson, broadcaster, Instagram sensation, and the founder of the amazing Glazette, and whose wardrobe, I bet, is full of brilliant treasures. Hello, hello, hello. How are you? Come in. Welcome. Thank you. This is the uh, the bedroom where the magic doesn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> well, obviously oh. your house is beautiful as expected. Yes. I think I'm quite. Um, if you enjoy it. Yeah, I do. I go through phases where I think, oh, I haven't bought anything for ages. Yes. I must go shopping. Yeah. Um, or it's kind of more buying something for somewhere that I'm going. I think every morning when I get up, I'll look out the window and figure out what the weather is, or try to figure out what the weather yeah, is yeah. in England, um, and dress according to weather, where I'm going, what I'm doing, and how I want to feel. Okay. I do, I, it's organised. Do you think? Yeah, and it's not overloaded with stuff. I mean, I know your hubby's been removed from the wardrobes. Bless him. In Britain, women wear 30% of their wardrobe. No. So, yeah, so if you think it's probably like, per month, like five outfits, it's really not a lot we wear. That's terrible. Yeah, it's, it's frightening. It is scary. And that, I mean, that's the whole point about Relux as well, is like trying to edit your wardrobe, mm. sell it back in to other people who might want something. Buy it back. Mm. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Buy it back and then see, and mm. then try and make the most out of what you have or mend it, fix it, yeah. etc. Um, I think one of them would be this Kate Spade. Yes. Jumper. I did a job with them and um, they had this beautiful jumper and I asked if I could have it nice when it went. Nice colour for you. Yeah, it's cute. I kind of begged them actually, didn't ask, I begged them to have it when it went into production. You sold it? And well, they never made it and oh, they very kindly gave me really the sample. Did. Oh, that's nice. It's nice colour, I like it. With good with jeans. So are there any fashion sort of secrets, things that you probably should get rid of or your husband hates or that are just nonsensical but you just have to hold on to them? How many? Uh, I do have a weird like a La label still on. Oh, that's a Naughty. really bad habit. I really like keeping the labels on because it's the northerner in me always thinking that it's new. But hang on, stop. But you'll still wear them. Yeah. You'll keep the label on and wear it. Yeah. Maybe okay. it's because when I was I like it. really young, I used to wear it and take it back take to Topshop. Yeah, no, I was thinking that you've never worn it, but you still keep it on. Oh, no, it's got mark. It's got like marks. Like probably got food on it. Anything else that you maybe should be getting rid of or selling with Relux and you've never worn? Or I see something. Yes. So this. That's cute. It is cute, but I. I Have you worn it? I bought it years ago. Um, in a sample sale and I haven't worn it, no. I haven't worn it for years. Maybe I can't get rid of it because I bought it in a sample sale and, you I know. I don't know if that's such an emotional connection, a sample sale. Oh, yeah, I probably had a I really nice time. I don't think you need to. Let's get, that, get, let's get rid of that. When you go through your wardrobe, you just need to take your time. Look, it's really big on my shoulders. Yeah. I don't think it's that flattering. That's something, and if you're not wearing it, it's probably for that reason. But then nice colour. But when I button it up, does it look like my shoulders fit? No. Oh God. <laughs> I think that could go as well. Oh no! Like, this is good. Detach. Okay. I think that's the thing is you have to... What is that going as well? Yeah, that's oh, definitely God. going. And there must be some others. Oh. Okay, I've got something that you're gonna actually like and let me keep. <laughs> um, what? I like that. I like that for me. Yeah, that's, that's a, gorgeous. That's a cute little Miu jacket. I want that. That's a good one. That was from Vista Village. Ooh. Yeah. Got it in sale. Um, and um, and this is a weird. Oh, well, that's got, nice. This is a cute little vintage wire. Can I try one. that one? Yeah. This is really this sweet. Um, I got this in Paris. 
You can Ooh. try this one. And I'll try this other one on. It's kind of, this is a, another. Oh, this is yummy. It's cute, isn't it? Oh, I love. <laughs> so I'll buy this off you. Mm. This is gorgeous. <laughs> Lovely. And then this is, I bought this at the same, no, I don't know if I bought this at the same time. Oh, that's This is nice. just like a really cute yeah, that's little. That's so easy. Oh, God, I've been looking for these. Oh, new, this is brilliant. Another white reason why we edit wardrobes is to go to see pockets. I love that. I love these. I really want it to be the sex <laughs> on the city <laughs> episode. You know, where she just always yeah. wear these. I thought I'd try and bring them back. They're, no one's interested yet. No, they me. are. They are actually, especially cool. in Paris. They are. Um, I think we've done oh, really well. Here. Poo bags. Poo bags oh, and a screwdriver. <laughs> Not gonna, go, ask, not gonna ask any questions. I don't go anywhere without my poo bags and a screwdriver. It's so weird. Poo bags get everywhere. God, they're so weird. And also then when anyone's like, if you got a bag, I'm like, like yeah, I do actually. I actually have 10 of them. How do you shop um, vintage? What are you like? pre-loved. I mean, are there pieces that you're always searching for? Well, I love buying second-hand stuff. Yeah. I, I, I'm, this is a really old APC one, and it was one of the first things that I actually went into a shop and, and like looked around and bought, bought when something. I was in New York. That's nice. Because I, and it was when I was like, oh, actually I've got some money in my bank account where I'm not worrying about what I'm eating every yeah, month. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You actually like, yeah, treated yourself. And it's such a like cute little, yeah, it's, super it's nice. just like really easy. Um, I bought these, I found, I basically, oh, Chloe. yeah. I had alerts on every website. These are so nice. They have them in the navy That's as well. The, yeah, I really want them in the blue. Yeah, these are gorgeous. You'll be able to find them. They, it, they come in. I find getting things like this. They come in waves. Suddenly you can't you can't find them for ages, and suddenly there'll be like yeah. a spout of people getting rid of them. So you obviously are on the hunt for the Chloe trousers. Mm -hmm which we will definitely keep an eye on on Relux. And then I know you were one of the lucky few who I think got up at 6.30 in the morning yes. to get, we call it Banana Gate at Relux. Really? Yeah, because they have been, I've been looking <gasps> one for one, I think since I was a student at St. Martin, so about 10 years, and I've never managed to find one. I think one was on sale at Depop for a ridiculous amount of money. Yes. One for like a thousand pounds, seeing that one, I think it's the only one. And when we started Relux, we suddenly got Mr. Banana Top and we got three or four of them and it was the most bizarre thing. Like one thing I have loved on Relux is going through like what's new and just looking through people's wardrobes. Yes, yeah. I find that we have really I mean good. we're so lucky that we have amazing access to like obviously stylish women's wardrobes and we are trying to do a curation and keep it edited down mm. so you're not churning through. And also just trying to keep it, the prices reasonable. Well, yeah, mm. we do have the Chanel's and stuff, but also have those sort of sweet 150 pound pieces that people can buy into yeah. as well. How have you found your sort of detox closet relux edit? Great, I kind of, I would be nervous. How are you feeling emotionally? <laughs> well, I'm a bit sad to let go of these things. We are still taking them. Um, I think that it's nice to make room to buy more things. <laughs> yes, and buy more pre-loved. Yeah, I, I, 100%. Right. I, the, there's things that I do have that are new, but I think as I'm shopping now, it's more... More aware. More aware, secondhand, yeah. pre-loved. And I actually love the thought of wearing something that someone once really treasured, but oh, then is passing on. Yeah. Thank you so much for doing our first edition of Closet Relux. I am going to take these pieces. Oh, well, I'm going to still keep these though. Yeah, okay. you, that I give you permission, and these we will be taking. Great. Bye. Oh.